imagine another school year that has rambled to an end. One that has brought more activities and fun than ever before. It's the end of a year which brought the sweet song of victory as well as the bitter murmur of defeat to our school and our athletes. It's the end of a year which saw spring blossoms burst forth in January, yet this year brought more cold and rain than ever before to our campus. The first big doing took place in October. That's right, the Sound Off Rally. Blue Berets punctuated the throng of freshman French as they competed in their first rally. The sophomores were fierce savages who boiled and devoured at dawn as their tall spears glinted in the sun. The junior jurors were all set to recreate courtroom drama as they tried and found guilty at dawn. Their white flags with red gavels and red neckties with a white J gave them a finishing touch. The little old winemaker, along with Bernardo Pooch, led the class of 63 as they trapped Speedy Gonzales. Their Spartan spirit finally proved to pay off in the end. Oh, little old winemaker, won't you please tell me the famous story of the senior Swiss? Well, I, I don't know. Oh, please. Who, me? Yes, you. Well, no, no, all right. Well, let me see now. Once upon a time in the far land of the senior Swiss, there was this big cheese that was known throughout the land as the uh, big cheese. Yeah, well, anyway. Uh, now, now, this big cheese was the pride and the joy of the senior Swiss, and it was guarded by the faithful mascot, Bernardo. Kind of a wild kid. Well, anyway, Bernardo, one day, by mistake, fell asleep. And, you know, well, it was kind of a vile night and everything, you know. And he, he kind of looked around, but he, he fell asleep. And all of a sudden, out of nowhere, comes this famous rat, Speedy Gonzales. Oh, and he creep around, he look around, you know, and he kind of sniff in the air, you know. Mm. And all at once, he look up and he see the cheese. And boy, he know he's going to take a big bite out of that cheese. And all of a sudden, oh, wait a minute. He see Bernardo. He look at Bernardo, you know. He don't know, boy. He don't know if he had to try this or not. So he walk up to Bernardo, you know, and he kind of look and see if he's sleeping. Ah, he's sleeping. And run there. There we go, there we go. He walk around him. And now he's going to run up to the cheese, he's going to take a big bite out of the cheese, and all of a sudden... Let's listen to the announcements of the Sound Off Rally winners at halftime at the Arroyo game. With these announcements completed, everyone knew that the sophomores came in second and that the senior Swiss had won.
Remember the various noises that traveled each hall identifying it? They well echo in every Spartan's head as he recalls each corridor. Sea Hall was characteristic of the beating of spoons against mixing bowls in home ec classes. I'll never forget those mouth-watering aromas that tantalized me as I walked by. The rhythmic clickety-click-ding of the typewriters lived in Sea Hall, too. Again. I'll never forget S-Wing, for that matter. There is never a dull or quiet moment. Always a hot rod being souped up, or else sawing, pounding, grinding, hammering. More erudite classes, as English classes sounded completely different. Take Mr. Mahaffey's class discussing a controversial book. For instance, Uncle Tom's Cabin. We'll start off with a, dis with a discussion on the American Negro situ situation and the prejudice against the Negroes, who, uh, who there's been many uh, authors written on them ever since the pre-Civil War days when Uncle Tom's Cabin was written. Or listen to a foreign language class. We are in the Bremer Rats Keller. The Keller is overfilled. Zwei amerikanische Studenten kommen aus der Oper. Sie haben Wagners die Meistersinger von Nürnberg gesehen. Wie hat dir die Oper gefallen? Sie war wunderbar. Der Tenor war ausgezeichnet. Suchen Sie einen Platz, meine Herrschaften? Bitte, setzen Sie sich an diesen Tisch. Sind Sie Ausländer? Ja, wir sind Amerikaner. Haben Sie schon die deutschen Weine probiert? Nein, noch nicht. Herr Ober, kommen Sie bitte her. Womit kann ich dienen? Wir haben Rudesheimer, Kochheimer, Johannes Berger und eine importierte Schwiss-Kolonie. Sagen Sie mal, wann sehen wir ein paar hübsche Mädchen? Gnädiger Herr, wir sind hier nicht auf der Freiheitsstraße in Hamburg, sondern im Bremer Ratskeller. That was one of Mrs. Wheeler's German classes. Spartans sound off, even in a foreign language. And the year of sound at Castorelli High School comes to an end. Now turn the record over and hear the excellent Spartan musical groups in concert.